Hi Bruce from Safari here and we're on the back of a Ford Ranger 217 and we're going to introduce you to Mark in a minute but Mark put in the black bridge here that you'll just zoom in a little bit you can see it here running and copper flex panels a few other things Mark how are you yeah good thanks yeah tell us what do you like about the system now you've had it running for a while yeah I do I have I like it I do um I like the neatness of the screen. Uh, I've had a um, Cymarine screen before in my last car, so I was happy to go in it, with it again. I like just the, the neatness of the switches. I like how they're marked with what I want um, and things like that. They're backlit. They've got this beautiful backlight that just comes on. It's You don't even know it's happening. It's all very quick. So they've actually just, because it's got a bit dark here, they've actually come up a bit more. I, I've got pretty much all the modules that I would want out of it. Um, I just like being able to monitor things separately uh, with it, with the different shunts and stuff. Um, uh, my water tank, I've got the water tank level uh, with it all because it has a 45 litre water tank in it. i um, uh, got a couple of different temperatures, from, one from a fridge, one for the, what's inside of the canopy. The, I never know how to say it, probably if it's the... Inclimiter. Inclimiter, all right. I love that because I run a rooftop tent, so it's set. I like being level when I'm sleeping. I've got this funny thing, I know people can sleep on different angles, I can't. So I can go to that and I know the car's level. So um, I don't know, I just like the whole, the whole system i just like the neatness of it it just all looks really neat and Alrighty. it all goes with it all so let's yeah. go around to the other side yeah <clears throat> now have a look at this on this side uh now mark i'm going to score you on this i think i'm going to give you buddy 10 out of 10 mate i don't mm -hmm. do that for the two people here this is uh this is top class on the way that mark's done this and uh so this is the blackbridge control unit that you can see here and i'll just flick this open uh, these are the fuses and if for some reason the screen goes down you can turn the lights on and off with a little relay here where my finger is um, I think of it as really a very upmarket um, Red Vision product and then we've got the smart controller we've got the uh, smart uh, charger there that you see as well coming in from the vehicle and um, we've got a 240 volt uh, amp charge he's got the breaker he's got it all labeled there uh, Mark pretty impressive I think yeah and if you're to do it all again any changes um no, actually, no, not really. I'm actually, it took me a long time to work out the layout of it all and to where I wanted everything to go. And it, that was the hardest part. Once I had it laid out, it was, wasn't that hard to do, but I'm actually happy with where it's all laid out. Now I'm on top of the uh, Ranger, the Motop, and here's the Copper Flex on the top. And he's got these two in series and then in parallel. So look at this on the Motop here, four of the 100 watt panels fit absolutely perfectly it's an absolute exact fit so that's 400 watts on top of it uh, each panel i think is 1.7 kilos so you're adding um a total layer of what's that 6.8 kilos very little at all so, can we yeah. say hello to your dog in the back yeah yeah this little hansel Hansel. hansel come over here and say hello right here he is hi yeah. hansel how are you Hansel's a year and a half he's a like year and a half old yeah right? he needs a haircut he's, and he's, a haircut he's there, so. an important part of the rig he is, he is, so, i've yeah. got to say guys and gals out there there's the rooftop tent i've got to say how good's that eh? 